Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Hearts of Iron 4 Road to 56 as Italy and the recreation of the Roman Empire. So, a lot of you decided, oh, actually two things. Puppets. Yes, you want me to grab puppets. Overwhelming amount of you said, keep them as a puppet. Two, second thing, the map. Yeah, you said it wasn't very accurate, so I switched to this one, which... Seems to be a bit more detailed, like the client states right here. And uh, I think right here with the areas from Crimea that you very much asked for. And yeah, as we can see right here, we can see by the rivers that... Um, well, technically, if we look at the things I took... Only this area is wrongfully taken. Because I'm gonna, if I'm gonna follow this river, then I kind of have to grab these territories. Because all of them are kind of connecting. But yeah, one state is about wrong. Otherwise, I think we're still doing this kind of correctly and very Roman. So, first order business this episode. Where to expand next? It's actually a re very big real question right now. Whoever we are justifying against will be protected by the allies if it's not a fascist target. Right now, we don't have that many fascist people around the world. If we check our, well, faction map mode, it's us plus Hungary. We are not connected to any fascist nation that is not us. I'm thinking of just buying myself some extra time to build up our divisions, to get some anti-tank guns right here. And, um, yeah, then later just strike into, well... The allies, basically. Uh, we're also preparing a massive naval build-up so we can start to challenge the English Navy. Um, yeah, otherwise in that we are pretty much... Wait, who are you fighting? Oh, it must be something... No, wait, you're not fighting. That's just some random other naval battle that we don't actually know about. Uh, or, well, know what it is right there. Oh, right, 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 Saudi Arabia. But you are now guaranteed by... Okay, the big question is now, will we declare war against Saudi Arabia and, well, no, actually, the Allies within 60 days or 70 days, 90 days? I severely doubt it. So we're gonna cancel this justification. Sad face, but yeah, we have to do it. Uh, we can't deal with the Allies right now. So let's just wait, relax, and take it easy. So Union sent six divisions to China. Maybe we should send some to Italy to try to help them right there. Uh, provincial government of Republic of China. Huh. All right. Uh, let's see. Should we send and help them some? We have experience. We have everything. I don't want to waste equipment. So no, we're not going to do it. Construction level two. Oh, I don't have any sound. Oh, there we go. Uh, let's see what to pick next. What? Oh god, we have so much. We haven't even started on this. Are there any? Is there anything we're missing right there? Oh wait, we're ex importing 56. Well, we have 86 too much right now. So let's stop with that. Uh, let's see. We need to trade for some tungsten. We need to trade for some rubber, please. Otherwise, actually, some oil too. And now we're fine. We should still gonna plus on, well, civilian factories right there. We traded for a lot of steel. So, right here. We are in time for everything. We're going for attack right here. Research bonus right there. Basically, we went the left side. Uh, let's see. Doctrines, we are doing the next one. And the tank guns, we're getting artillery. Not yet, but, well, kind of. Uh, logistics and field hospital, I need it. Thank you, we're currently at extensive conscription and we have only 1 million manpower right now. Might be tight, but let's... We're gonna make sure that Germany becomes uh, Let's see, what is it? If Germany becomes a satellite... No, no, Reich Commandant, they're gonna give us a lot of factories and they're gonna give us, well, manpower. We, we can basically fix everything pretty well. So, yeah, I'm, I will force them down one more level whenever I feel like I have the time and not something critical to build. Oh, wait! 
This one I was like, huh, I'm not super good, let's not pick this. But getting two synthetic refineries, that's something completely different. That's 14 uh, oil and 8 rubber. Yeah, 14 oil and 8 rubber. That's pretty goddamn good. Yeah, we're definitely getting this. those two. Uh, are you doing anything critical right now? Uh, Fortress Italia, more naval bases. Naval base is not naval Okay Here also a lot of resources Very nice Go after France Okay we have a focus for go after France We can wait a bit We can take a com Like I want these four That's 710 no, seven, That's three, uh, 280 days um, Let's see Fortification effort We're gonna go get that one either way So 280 and so about a year before we declare war. All right, all right. That gives my good perspective about how quickly I need to be done and finish with everything. So uh, why haven't picked anyone anything right here? Why haven't why have we picked up? Really, we have had more critical things to grab. Maybe we have. Uh, let's actually double check right here. Uh, personal cult, divine inspiration, secular institution, will of the people. Uh, we can't grab that one. Uh, we could almost go this one. But democracy support is too high there. Um, personal call, justification war goal, community support plus 0 0.5. I'm actually fine with that. Uh, daily public power cost minus 7.75. National unity, research time. <laughs> yeah, and we're not picking that one. Uh, let's pick personal cult then. Actually, let's double check the two other ones. Ba balance approach, individual rights above all. Wow. That one is ridiculous. Division organization plus 15%. Are you kidding me? S uh, some of this stuff are not really balanced in my opinion. But um, I'm going to use everything as they are in the game right now. Uh, let's see. Nope. Nope. Ah, I like you. Let's see. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out if there's something wrong with this plan of, plan of thought. Uh, I don't think so, right now at least. We might have to switch you out much later, but for now that's just 5% less research speed. Give me that. Uh, so we're currently at 16%. Republic of Finland declared one Red Finland. Alright, let's see. You are communist, you are democratic, we want none of these to win really, so just fight and die. Tibet declared war on China. <laughs> really Tibet? Aren't you a tiny bit too aggressive now? You haven't even finished off t <laughs> Bhutan right now. And the Spanish Civil War, alright, who won right there? And the Nationalists, alright, cool. Which means I can declare war. Oh, someone commented about that. Someone said that in our comments. Said, um, yeah, basically... Let National Spain win, so you can just find a clear war against them. And that's exactly what I should be doing. Get everyone back right here. Get to this front, but I'm gonna steal a couple of units. Let's say... Um, I don't know. If, how, what kind of research do we have right now? Is it only 10? Uh, yeah, we're gonna fix that too. But um, then we're gonna do like this. Two divisions. You're gonna be assigned right there. Please. Two divisions next. You from here to there. Next two, please. Uh, you two, congratulations. You from there to there. Assign. Let's see, you two. From there to there. And you two from there to there. I did not plan this. I did not count it. It was just perfect aligning. We have a Port up here, we have a port down there. A city, a city. Perfect. Alright. What should we begin with? Or should we grab this? What is it that we actually need? Do we need oil? Or rubber? Yes and no. Actually, yes. Only yes. Never mind. Never mind. It's only yes. <laughs> and we're probably going to need more of it. So let's let's just grab that one. Those are good focuses. 
Uh, the rest of you, let's just make sure that I select all of you and no one else. Cool, let's delete that order. And you're gonna be placed out, let's see, right there in those two provinces. Basically both of them have ports and I can very easily just send them over. Cool. Uh, National Spain, I need to justify against you, please. 80 days, awesome. You are not guaranteed by anyone. I will be mad if you're guaranteed by anyone. Takeover of civilian factories. Aw, oh, goddammit. I was hoping that was gonna increase something ridiculous, like change five civilian factories to ten military or something. That would've been awesome. What the hell are you doing? There. Cool, and uh, no troops right there. Invite to faction. Japan. And uh, no, we were not re you were not really in the Roman Empire, so uh, I will kind of avoid that. I want to keep it kind of restricted to the Roman Empire too. Not too much interaction with the rest of the world. But I will have to declare war on everyone, well, right here. Uh, actually, I need to make it better. Right here. That's more fitting. So, it will be a lot of wars. So, if I can skip Asia, I will probably skip Asia. Alright, let's see. Anti-tank guns ready. Let's get the next artillery while we're getting some anti-tank production up and rolling. Uh, let's let you stay on two full lines. Actually, no. I'm gonna let you stay at one line. Because I'm that cruel. No. I said it was nice to have some fighters. I pretty much didn't know where to pick or what to pick, so I just assigned them as dire bombers, because why not? And now we actually have something better to pick. Let's expand everything and make our new group something better. From here, 1000, I wanna see. So the dive bombers, together with some Stukas from Germany, and then the rest of the fighters in one here, and then some interwar bomber, very good. And let's see, we can also assign some torpedoes. And let, come on, shop shop, you're gonna be assigned right here. The rest of you are just gonna move over as soon as you are done. Come on, very good. Let's do that and that, very good. You, unselect that one, select this one. P prospect for oil, thank you. Let's go Libyan refineries. So four more right there, right away. And then also the two Syntec refineries. So we should be able to switch this one out now, very nice. Okay, we still need to trade for two, but I'm gonna trade for one because we're gonna get more right away. Then we also have the re these ones left. Uh, excavation techs. So that's gonna increase, well, how much we're getting from everything. So that's why buildings are extra good. Uh, we're exporting eight, so let's just cancel that. And we have enough rubber. Excellent. We, we really need more just political power right now. Oh, we could have grabbed this one. Less just vacation time. Eh. We could always just go power and politics. But feels kind of unnecessary. Uh, this one I want. Non-core manpower plus 2%. <laughs> well, we want the war industrialist too. Backroom backstabber could be something. Just to ideological drift defense. Because I was a tiny bit worried about this one. Just a tiny bit. Okay, there we go. You are done, you have less units than me, you have a good amount of military and civilian factories, I want all of that. And you were part of the Roman Empire, let's double check the map, whoop. Yes, big red, and well, in my empire. So, declare this war, let's go. And all of you, please land. Uh, right here we should be able to, no, fight. I knew it, fighters wouldn't have their range, but what should have range, let's double check, just Spain, about 200 planes, uh, and not all of you are gonna be fighters, so I'm gonna take my 200 strat bombers, and if I don't mess up once again, actually, I did mess up, so you're gonna do this, just close air support, helping our troops land there, everyone is going, very good, so the rest of you are now gonna delete that order, and just be unassigned right there. Uh, what's my fleet doing? What is my fleet doing? You are, yes, fire at will and you're gonna be on convoy escort. Good, you instantly came and re rescued them. <laughs> God, th that was lucky. Cool. You landed right here, very nice. You're gonna get your support quite soon. 
Why spreading out instead of being very focused? Well, it's always best to spread out. Like, no question about it. Always spread out if you can. And now you're landing. Because if you spread out, you also have a big good opportunity. Even if you intercept some of the stacks. Well, you might always land on some other places. Come on, shop, shop. Uh, right here, we should we should have grabbed that one. Let's see, everyone except you. Yeah. You, you, and you. Please jump over right there. We don't have enough room for that. Okay, you tackle bomber. You can stay right there. But still be assigned right there. You have kind of bad... Bad... Um, mission efficiency. But still, it, I think it will be good enough. Uh, all of you guys right here. Come on, just land. The point was to, for you two to land. Uh, so were two of these retreated? No, you weren't. Okay, everyone is finally here. Cool. That means delete some orders. One line. Very good. Oh, only nine divisions. So someone was taken out. Sad face. Disband, disband. All of you. Get over. Get over right here and push as much as possible. I know we won't be able to supply all of this right now, but... I'm planning to expand quite quickly and I want to, well, disrupt them with shock. Just as quickly as freaking possible. Be very aggressive. Libyan refineries, thank you for that. And we're done right there. Libyan infrastructure, I really want to pick this one. But we're going to pick that one just before we declare war upon uh, France. So Fortress Italia, more naval bases, rearmament and resource extraction. Fortification, go after France. Ah, we might do this one. Yeah, we, we'll probably pick these four, fortification, violate Swiss neutrality, because if they, well, actually wait, you're independent. Or you're not independent, but you're a free state. I might be able to get you without, let's grab you right now. Because if I manage to annex you, that's just more land for me. And much e easier to invade France. We won't have to deal with this mountain range and fort, or this one with forts. We can just go straight in here, right in the middle, so that we pretty got them awesome. Emperor artillery, let's just upgrade it right away, not that one, this one. Let's not lose all our efficiency right now. Uh, right here, everything is fine, very good. We just need more artillery. So artillery, 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 you have one full, okay. You need one and a half full, maybe. <laughs> uh, let's trade a bit more with you. Cool, we're just going in and, yeah, we're just wrecking. Uh, you are never assigned. You never helped. You never helped our tackle bombers. Ouch. Well, it should it should probably been fine. But yeah, we're going much much faster right now. Spain, you are still very much damaged from the civil war, so I'm just sweeping you up right now. And then I, it would be nice if we could sweep up Portugal too. But the big question right there is, well, the Allies will probably intervene. So, if we have everything assigned that should be assigned, nice. Let's grab fire right here because it looks better. Literally, that's the only reason. It looks better. We probably don't need it, but it looks better. Let's see. We're fine in everything. Yeah, good. This is what I like to see. Good amount of extra equipment that we can just feel safe about. If we need more troops, then I can forcibly deploy some more. Well, not right away, but quite quickly. Uh, let's see, no, like that. And yeah, go. Let's see, small arms firepower, armored operations, very good. Let's grab both of those. Oh, let's grab the continuation, heavy firepower plus 12% heart attack. And right here, let's continue on infiltration assault. Supply cost up your mind, 10%, thank you. Let's see, free military factories. So, here's a big question. What kind of equipment do you have? Ah, uh, you. Still disappointed, alright. That means we're definitely gonna need one full right there. And let's add half more right there. I was remembering, well, we don't have logistics company right now, so we're probably gonna need it. So, I think this calls for just take all state and thank you. Good, oh wait. <laughs> I was talking about Switzerland in right here. We have a good invasion point right here now. We just need extra troops. Troops to basically, well, Make it possible for us to deploy stuff everywhere. So let's deploy in 21 stacks extra troops. 
And uh, that's, I think, about what we should be able to support. Siam goes to war against the Allies. Wow. Brave man. Uh, let's go artillery and at least half or more. That's what we need. Let's see. Scientific community, thank you. So, uh, oh, actually, we have one more right here first. Specialized, I was gonna pick this one, just 5% more. So, we're currently at minus 21%. We could go up to free trade for another, is it 5%? Yeah. But let's not, let's avoid that for now. Let's see. Justification wartime, we won't need that one. Uh, what we do need was, was it law enforcement? Oh, this one. But that's more cost, and that's currently what we don't have. Oh, right. Uh, let's see. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Prince of Terror, right here. A tiny bit more manpower right there, but it's at least much better. Instead of, we're getting double the amount of recruitable population from lands that are not our own. So, that's insane. Uh, just for, actually, actually, we're going back to hopefully grab Switzerland. So, everyone, get over there. You're not guaranteed by anyone, so it should be just a numb, and you're gone. And with numb, I mean eating them from all sides, in one very big shoe. Uh, all of you, planes, uh, actually you are not... Let's just disband you for future use. Uh, let's select you, and like this, all of the rest, go back to that airbase, and assign right here. Cool. Let's see, unassigned divisions. Actually, we have already produced some. Good. All six right here. Get in and blitz order. I don't want you to think about anything. I don't want you to not attack for some god reason because they're very much superior. I want you to go all in. Just charge ahead, close your eyes, do whatever you need to do. Just go straight ahead. So, Fortress Italia, thank you. Actually, uh, place Fortress on... Uh, all right, cool. Yeah, I like that. You are a free state, or you are in the faction free states. Only you. You have a, uh, not really anything. This should work, and no one should intervene. Declare war, charge. Just go in, grab everything, every land. Attack, no mercy. I don't like this unit. You attacked, you were losing, you still attacked, and then they're pushing you back. But that helps for everyone else. No one can retreat, no one can reinforce anywhere else. You're just going for it. Which is exactly what I wanted, and you're doing exactly what I wanted. Well done. Well done, and thanks. Cool, thank you. That was it. So we got a nice boost of civilian and military factories. For, a, well, two very short and easy wars, to be honest. More battleships. Actually, you are... Wait, you're battleship level 2. You're exactly... You Both of you are exactly what I need. Okay, I'm just gonna let you continue forever. Yeah, I see no, no problems to that at all. And what we do need to be very careful and remember is... We need to trade for everything right now. Everything! Every single resource. We need everything. So... I'm thinking of one thing. I'm gonna show you quite soon. Uh, I'm pretty sure I saw something right here. Yes. If we go down this path, we can get some more steel. But getting steel feels like a hell of a bad thing to do. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Yo, right. The oh, crap. These general stuffs are really good. Less division attrition. Oh, crap. That's awesome. We need to grab that now. Uh, we have so much research, like ridiculously much research. Okay, and uh, we can get one big front line right there, and I'm just gonna employ 16 of you right here, just so we have something. And you guys are gonna go from here, like this. Uh, let's first assign everyone to that, and then select, select, and 16. Cool. Just so we have something, and don't forget about our target. Uh, kind of close in colors, but I'm fine. I'm fine. Let's accept it. Uh, let's see. Industry. Oh, God. We, we can now continue right here. But we want to go here, and we want to do this, and we want to do this, and we want to do this. Way too much. This is why I want the research <laughs> bonuses. So I can just do all of it very quickly. Um, I'm actually going to go down and grab the... No, attrition. We have good amount of... 
we actually have really good amount of extra supplies right now so we don't really need a reduction in attrition even though it would be really great what we need and need is excavation we are producing everything yeah we're producing everything but we're still missing stuff we need would need to grab turkey that would be nice just for all that chromium is there any fascist nation with chromium are you fascist no no uh, Siam, no, but you are. Well, you might be war with the allies if you declare it. Any fascist nation that has chromium, no. Uh, come on, then. Research map mode. Resource map mode. Uh, let's see. Research map mode. That could be kind of cool. Uh, some small chromium areas, right? Oh, here. Cuba. God damn it. Democratic. I'm just hoping that Road 56 changed something. Because you seem to be changed. Yeah, Republic of Venezuela. Oh no, you had a civil war. And apparently the allies won right there. Or the Democrat, Democrats. Alright. Uh, let's see. You are building up our navy. Very good. That's what I said I wanted. But I kind of need to focus on some more military factories right now. Oh wait, this is mostly German stuff. Ugh. Okay, we can focus right here at least. So let's do well six, eight, nine, ten. I don't want you. Well, I kind of want you, but not now. Um, three, yeah, six, twelve. Because everything we build, all oh right, everything we build right here in Germany is gonna help us since we still get some of them. Uh, if we check right here, we get uh, sixty-five percent of their military production. And we're gonna get even more if we, well, force them down even more. So this might actually be something. Hmm. Cool. Uh, I'll let's think about it. Uh, right, first of all, let's just go down the here and get everything right there. Oh, that's actually 8 Chromium. That's nice. Uh, naval base expansion in Sicily and other areas. Alright. So basically, yes, some nice and peace. We took two nations this session. Italy, or Sp <laughs> I've been playing against and killing Italy way too many times. Like last episode, I started with saying we're at war with Italy. And I was like, oh crap, should I start over again? Uh, let's see, hopefully people don't mention it or recognize it. Of course I saw it and poked. My, one of the first comments was, Daniel, you said this. And I was like, oh crap. I should never try to avoid <laughs> anything. If I say something stupid, you're going to call me out on it. Uh, yeah. We took Spain and we have taken Switzerland. So I think my nation and my people deserve some peace and quiet. For the moment at least. Uh, some more steel please and some more tungsten. Uh, did we do excavation tech? Yes we did. And I'm going to probably continue with that too. I'm going to pick excavation 2 and construction 3 so we can get excava excavation 3. Uh, right now, we yeah, that would improve our nation quite a bit. Just getting more and more of those, all those researchers by ourselves. Sure, we could go down to export, or actually we are already at limited. Okay, that would only be closed, and we're getting quite a bit from trade, so I don't really want to do it. Go to, well, closed economy. United Kingdom... United Kingdom declared war on Belgium. And now they justify against us. We did play with unhistorical focus. So. Wait. Not in an offensive war. Wait. They are not in offensive. One in offensive war. Cost more than 30%. Current party not democratic. It's not in faction. It's not at peace. Okay. Yeah. They can do it. Hmm. So you are now at war with me. Should we strike France then? Right now. No, what we do should do and will do is desperately recruit more soldiers. Let's see, how is our, how are current standing? Really good. So now you're gonna feel the might of the Italian Empire. It feels weird saying it, but that's what you're gonna have. Cool, more and tank guns, everyone have it. Deploy troops. 50 more troops. Actually, 10 of you. Let's grab 11 of you and assign down here. And I want one more full stack. Yeah, sure, we're missing any tank guns, but the rest of it should be fine. Actually, artillery is not fine. 
Now artillery, 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 right there you need five more factories. And right here we can no longer spare playing around with uh, fun little stuff like, um, well, naval factories and think of the future. It's now. Right now. We need to do it right now. Uh, let's see. War Greece. No fortification effort. Let's grab that one, please. And what we also need to do is protect right here. Because now we actually have quite a bit of resources. Uh, not, maybe not quite a bit, but some resources. So what I want to do is you guys... All of you should be deployed right here as soon as I possibly can. Or as just before the war, at least. Let's see. You are allied and you are also allied. Yeah. But why haven't you... Yes, you have joined that war. So hopefully you'll be focused on Belgium for a while. Because I can declare this war in 15 days. And I'm going to do... Actually, should we do... Oh, wait, wait. What happened right here? Wait, was this a super quick... Uh... What the hell happened? Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. I was preparing everything. Where's the war with Italian focus? It was you, United Kingdom, right? Come on, I found it quite quickly before. Am I going... No, I'm not going insane, Daniel. You were not going insane last time. You are not going insane this time. Reinforced Empire. More with Italy. It was cancelled right away. Requires one of following. Not in an offensive war. You are in an offensive war right now. So it was cancelled right away. The AI picked it right away and then it updated and it was cancelled because... <sighs> Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Why do you always get super excited and just go extremely hardcore back and... No, no. We're supposed to have a war very quickly and let's go. You don't do that to me and then expect you expect me to get, expect to get away with it. No, you wanted a war. You are getting your war. Get over right here. Half of you get right there. And take that area. Actually, let's incorporate that area too. Uh, let's see. You can have your own commander. Messi. I hope you're good at football. But no. Right now, you're going to be good at defending my entire navy. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let's be let's, less, less aggressive with you. Uh, let's grab three divisions and assign right there. Because you need to grab that as quickly as freaking possible. Let's see. Offensive armies, you have only the infantry expert. You're also gonna have the maneuver. We need to be quick, gotta go fast. France, go to hell. How many more days? One more day. Good, they have no, nothing in the south right now. Alright, time for war with them. We, our troops right here is barely in place. Bring, bring this down, bring this down. Come on, quickly now, quickly now. Good, good, we got it right away. Awesome. Which means our fleet should be able to grab superiority right here. You shouldn't have a lot right here. We, it might be, well, the French Navy, but I might be able to beat it. Let's see. Um, I'm actually going to do this, just in case. Not there, not there. All you're going to do is search and destroy right here. Yeah, right there, not, not there. And we're going to take our airplanes and say... Oh crap, I didn't actually have you assigned anything. You were still right here. Torpedoes, right there. As this, and uh, let's see. Our, let's see, you and you get all right here too. As naval. Crap, crap, mistakes we made. And right there. These ones get down right here. Uh, no, 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 not you. Get back right here. Uh, is it you? Yes. Actually, all of you can do naval. So yeah, let's do naval with you. 
drag this down, down completely. Just bring you down. Oh crap, Front's actually pushing out. Oh wait, no, we are pushing, no, wait, yes, no, yes. What the hell is going on? We might be pushing in or pushing out, I'm not actually sure. I think, no, no, we are pushing in, good. Bring them down now. So it's unity clear one, Poland, okay, war <laughs> the war just, <laughs> the world broke just now. <laughs> uh, let's see, what, is there anything we need? Uh, we kind of need artillery because we have so much of it. Uh, no, I am don't definitely don't want to cancel that. Go in right here. Portugal, you're still going to trade with me. Otherwise, I'm going to just go in and crush you. Come on, bring down France. Oh, France actually losing now against Belgium. Very interesting. Right there, let's see. Any naval invasions? Not yet. We're basically just going to... Basically, basically, basically. We are going to guard everything right here as soon as we can. Lost 19 submarines, very good. Let's see, our entire navy, is, are you completely broken right now or are you still pretty strong? Uh, automatic split off, yes please. Just go back and repair whatever that needs to be repaired. Follow Cairo, very good. We are taking over Africa. We are just attacking them everywhere. They couldn't stand a chance right there. Well, they, they probably could stand a chance, but, well, they didn't have troops for this. Oh, we never called in our allies. Germany, you have a, quite a bit of troops. Yeah. Huh. I could have called you in. Uh, let's see, we could always just conquer Portugal. But for that, right now we're going to need our military police. And we don't have anything deployed right now as military police. Uh, let's get it out now. So, let's say 41 divisions. We have enough infantry equipment. Yes, we do. We have enough manpower. Awesome. Go in. Go in and just grab that. Heavy firepower, why is everyone moving from there? No, you're supposed to be right there. It's gonna be kind of an even split, please. You. Yeah, actually. France is capitulated, awesome. Everyone get over right here and clean this up first. And then you're gonna go south. Right there. And everyone get there. Clean this up. You are getting right here, very good. You are defending this. No naval invasions, just naval invasion in... What? For the island. Or it might be something else. Uh, let's see. We are now going to guard this one too. And let's see that one. Because we should have cut off most of the English navy. Well we have the defense right here. We have it. So they can't go in right here. And well naval invade me over this entire area. At least they shouldn't be able to. If they don't go through one of the allies. Or a small island or something. No we should have this completely locked down I think. Sometimes occupation transferring to the player with highest war score. I would say it works a bit wonky. It should go to either me or Belgium. For the love of God, not Japan. Uh, Alright. Uh, uh, we're just gonna let you take that over and then we're gonna be there to defend it. Uh, I don't really... Until we are taking Africa, I don't trust. You might be able to naval invade, invade like that. So for now, let's just do this with our troops and defend. Actually, yeah, right there we have something. And I want to guard this. I want to guard that. Let's see our entire main island. Like this. Thank you. And we have not called you in, so that should be safe. Then let's just unmark that. Cool. Now split up. These 21 divisions, you are going to be my golden stars. You're going to do exactly what I want, exactly when I want it. Uh, let's see. I'm going to grab additional free units right there. To just basically clean everything up. Since you can support 24 units, then let's just have you supporting 24 units. And we have actually made a quite a bit longer episode, uh, le episode than usual for now. We, uh, we have held it down to like 30 minutes quite often. But now I just got excited and we played for 40 minutes. So anyways guys, uh, thank you if you joined me for this episode. episode. Like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye and bye.